Hi, I'm Vanessa Zilke. I play for the women's Wolfpack soccer team. I'm from Kelowna and I play defense and I'm in health sciences. I chose TRU because it's only two hours away from Kelowna, so it was an easy transition and the soccer program looked like it was developing well. So what was the deciding factor on, on you coming here and playing for the Wolfpack? <laughs> um, probably just seeing the girls and then seeing the campus size. It seemed like a good size and lots of options for courses. What's the best thing about being a student athlete here at TRU? Um, there's definitely a lot of perks. Um, I'd say like the, in the athletic department, there's the Wolf Den so all the athletes can come and work on homework together and then there's the tutoring and just the whole atmosphere of being an athlete. It's got to be tough, but tell, tell me, how, how do you juggle the, the practices, the games, uh, the community activities, which we're going to talk about a little bit later here, and, uh, and obviously uh, being a student as well? Um, it's definitely very tricky, but I mean, all the girls on my team, we're all in the same boat, so we do do homework um, like sessions together, and yeah, it's just definitely a a balancing and just figuring out like when to when to study and around training and um, on road trips bring homework and do it on the bus if you can yeah. can you do it on the bus <laughs> um, I have a bit but usually it just ends up chatting and <laughs> sleeping because tired after long weekends <laughs> I guess what's been the highlight in, in your tenure here at TR? Um I've had lots of highlights so far so our first last two years we've um, gone to provincials and won against uh, UBCO which is my hometown and our big rivals so it was awesome coming first in provincials and then getting to go to Quebec our first year and then PEI the last year for nationals which was both amazing trips. Tell me about PEI. You got to, <laughs> you, you kind of went on a little side trip and you saw the beach. We did, yes. Um, Larry, you <laughs> took us to the beach. There's uh, about four or five of us girls and we got to go see the ocean and lots of us have never been out there before so it was just a great experience and I would have never done that if I hadn't come here. Tell me a little bit about the, 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 the family that the, the team is, has had. Like you, you become a family, do you not? Definitely become a family. Um, not only just our soccer team, just the girls team, but even with the guy, men's team and all the other athletic teams. It's just, yeah, it's, it's a whole family and everyone knows what's, what's going on and we're all training, we're all playing sports, we're all doing school, so right. it's good atmosphere. How about during the season? Like, do you have a, a particular uh, ritual and you know, how often do you practice every year? Uh, we practice um, five days a week. Um, Monday's usually a video session and then Tuesday to Thursday is training and then Friday um, we're either traveling or we have set plays and then Saturday, Sunday are our games. So it's definitely a busy week for that. <laughs> On your team, you're known as one of the trailer park girls. <laughs> yes. <laughs> There's a whole phenomena behind that. Can, can you tell me about that? There is. So after our first year, I uh, met Jadine and Maddie and we became great friends so we decided to move in to Jadine's place which happens to be um, in a trailer um, in a trailer park so yeah we've had a, a couple um, gatherings of uh, athletics so lots of people have been to the trailer and <laughs> it's been a great time and yeah I've made two best friends from it so. <laughs> Is that what you're going to remember most? I know you've still got some time to go here at TRU yeah. but are you going to remember obviously winning national champion or going to national championships winning provincial championships is that and getting a good education of course. <laughs> of course. <laughs> yeah, but are, is that what you're going to remember most about this whole experience? Yeah, I'm going to remember definitely a major part is the soccer, getting to go to nationals t two times in a row, like not a lot of people can say that and especially just all the friends I've made, they're going to be in my life for the rest of my life so I think that's a key part. Tell me about the community involvement that you do here. Oh, we do lots and I feel like our women's soccer is really big into it and we enjoy it. Um, lots of the things we've done, Terry Fox run, which is so fun to see the little kids and they look up to us so much and it's just so nice to see that we can be role models for them and Wendy's dream lift and there's just so many and I think it's a huge part that Wolfpack can be out there in the community showing that athletics aren't just athletics, we do other things. One final question, what words of advice do you have 
for uh, a potential athlete or the parent of a potential athlete looking at Thompson Rivers University? Um, I think if they're looking to go to a, uh, get a higher education and get a good education, um, TRU is a great place to go. And if they're wanting to be an athlete, then the Wolfpack's a great place to do it because they're growing and we're always winning. <laughs>